Hey guys, Chris again from ClassicVWBugs.com and in this quick tip I want to talk to you about aftermarket reproduction fenders. Uh, now if you're ever in a bind and you can't find good uh, NOS or good German fenders to uh, help you on your restoration, sometimes you are left with going with the reproduction. Um, now keep in mind that reproduction fenders are not as sturdy or as thick uh, as the original German uh, fender, so keep that in mind. The rear fenders are not so bad on the market today and you notice uh, this particular friend that we have has uh, dimples in between the bolt holes and that was a characteristic that was on the 50s Beatles so that's pretty cool to get one of these fenders if you need to reproduce or restore an older bug uh, but keep in mind too that the, the factory holes that they have here drilled are for 62 to 67 bug so if you have an earlier beetle that has the tail light that sits a little bit lower like the snowflake or the hard tail light you're gonna have to reposition those holes and fill those uh, factory holes plus this is also the bumper uh, override or support two hole there so if you have an earlier bug you might have to fill that hole as well uh, and when the fender is shipped in a big cardboard box don't be surprised if there's no packing in the box so if you find any dents or dings or scratches on the fender uh, that's very common it's uh, very expensive to ship these fenders today um, also understand that when you mount this fender uh, things are not going to line up correctly you might have to tweak it so especially in this lower portion here uh, it tends to flare out so you could have to bend that back to make sure it lines up with the running board and the lines of the car also if you're going to go for a reproduction fender I would suggest getting two uh, one for each side because they have to match if you have one original on one side and one repop on the other the lines are going to be different uh, and this fender ran about $155 from Bug City in Connecticut. It was IGP. It's a Brazilian make. Uh, I remember when these fenders were $20 a pop, and now they're uh, pretty expensive now. So, uh, But overall, if you're in a bind and you need a reproduction fender, these are pretty good, especially for the oval error here. This reproduction fender has the dimples in between the bolt holes, like I'll show again. Uh, but just keep in mind, you're going to have to tweak it. You're going to have to finagle this to make it fit right. And again, these tail light uh, holes here are for 62 to 67. So if you have a something 61 and early, you're going to have to re-drill those. And there's guides online on how to do that on the Samba. But here are, those dimples, uh, here are those dimples between the bolt holes, and that's very common on the oval bugs, 58 and 59 beetles. So if you are doing a good restoration, uh, this is a good repop uh, to show that kind of a characteristic if you're anal about that. Uh, but overall, not too bad. But if you want to get front reproduction fenders, uh, you've got to be careful with those because as you see here, this is the original front fender on this 54, and you see that defining line around the headlight bucket. Uh, the reproduction front fenders for 66 and earlier Beetles just do not have that defining line. Uh, it's kind of missing. It's, it's there, but it's not there. Um, so uh, I would suggest you to try to find a good, uh, a good German counterpart. So if you got the reproduction fender, you look kind of like this 67 fender you see here, more rounded. You won't have that line around the headlight. Uh, so just keep that in mind. If you don't care about that, that's fine. But you could go with a company like Classic Fab. This is Gerson. I've spoke about him once before, and he's doing some great stuff with panels on for bugs. And he does reproduce the oval window fenders, and that could work up to 66. But just keep in mind, they're about 500 bucks a pop, and that's without shipping. So, all right, guys, got any questions? Email me. Take care. Um, um, um.